Welcome back to the high seas of Stranded Deep. In the last episode, I came from my home, which is, let's see, that island right there. Now, it's been, uh, actually, it's been kind of like, uh, probably, it's been over a week since I last played. It's been a while. Uh, and basically, if you guys are just now joining me for my Stranded Deep series, essentially what I'm trying to do is find the oh wait let me look at my hunger and stuff first completely full uh, oh no uh what i'm trying to do is actually find the last part of the boat motor that's kind of like been my quest i can't believe some some people find the thing the components so quickly it drives me crazy like, I watch videos of people who just, like, started playing the game, and they're like, Oh, I've already got a boat motor assembled. Whee! Across the seas really fast. And it's like, I hate you. I want a freaking boat motor, man. <laughs> it takes me way too long to find things in this game, I swear. Okay, so I've already been to this island. And so I'm gonna... Just keep... We gotta watch out for it. <gasps> Don't you flip! It's nighttime here, guys. It's, it's Nighttime can be pretty scary. Um, okay, so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep going west. Let me just let me just do this. So there's my home right there in east. And I need to go I'm going to go to that island right there, okay? We're going we're basically just going to stay in a line because that's going to be the easiest way to find the things I need because essentially there's like if you guys are, if this is the first time you're watching this game uh, the instancing in this game is infinite it's a procedural I guess is what you call it where it, um, you can find the same thing multiple times in many different locations and you know is that a starfish things are ever uh, ever to be found uh, by any means pretty much going any direction and so nope I have cloth oh yeah I found that in the last time uh, I can craft this with something to make bandages crude bandages alright so I'm gonna go to that island which is sort of west cause to go back to my home I need to go like that so we're going to that island yeah basically the biggest thing is just like you don't want to get uh, i mean n now if let's say that i go to the wrong island um now i'm going to be able to find my way back easier because you know if i go if i'm going in the right direction but maybe i go an island too far to the left or something like that then i just know i just have to go the other direction and so it's pretty much not a problem anymore i don't think getting lost won't be but if I ever die. Somebody said in a comment the other day that they've survived for like 58 days or something like that. Just playing casually. Like, that's insane. Which also shows me that maybe this game's not as diff not as hard as it needs to be. And I still think the best way to kind of circumvent that is to have hurricanes or something like that. That just completely wipes your progress. Islands get destroyed. Um, trees get removed. You basically forces you to move or swim across the water to another island and so like I think that would be the best way to kind of help with like people who can survive that long because that seems like pretty outrageous uh oh shark somewhere oh no oh no I hate sharks let's see how keep going ah sharks are way more scary now way more difficult somebody was commenting about Okay, let me address this, okay? Uh, in the kindest way that I can. Somebody said, edit. Don't you, Entek, don't you know what editing is? <laughs> because all I, you know, most of Stranded Deep videos are me just paddling through the open ocean. And uh, what people don't realize, those people don't realize, is that this is part of the game. And it adds to the experience of the viewer it makes you feel immersive. Now, if you really wanted to feel immersive, I just wouldn't talk at all. And it make you feel like you're actually playing the game. Uh, but I give commentary where I talk about different topics and things that I think are very important. Especially about the game's development or about certain things. And so, uh, there's always commentary in these open 
ocean moments where I'm talking about some kind of point that I think is important to discuss. Uh, and if I was to edit down the video, okay, this is basically what would happen. Let's say that you wanted me to edit out all the rowing parts, or just the rowing parts where nothing's happening, right? Not like a shark attack or uh, searching below or something, just the paddling, okay? If I was to edit out all the paddling, you would have a five minute video. And then you would say, well, why don't you, you can still make them longer, just edit out the paddling. Well, what that essentially makes me do is play the game about eight times longer than what I usually do, thus basically get, making me have a very hard time. And then that's gonna kind of take away the, from the fun of, uh, of me making the video because I have to put in like eight hours worth of work for only a couple videos, you know, because I have to edit out so much paddling because, you know, I've had videos before where I was literally paddling for 10 minutes straight to get to another island. And, you know, that's just the case of the matter. So, you know, I, I, I have a lot of, I make a lot of videos because we have a wide, a very broad community of viewers and things. And, uh, oh, there's a buoy. Cool. I thought it was a whale at first. Um, and there's a lot of people who want to see different things. Now, the, the, the problem with that is, is that I don't have, like, the greatest views on every single video, but I have, like, pretty much average views on every single video because I have a community that's very split and not everybody wants to watch War Thunder or Stranded Deep or Unturned even. Um, you know, they want to watch a specific game that I put out. And so, um, you know, I have to make a lot of videos to kind of meet everybody's needs and so if I'm spending eight hours recording only a couple of videos or something for Stranded Deep that's going to really hurt the progress in this other video so you can see like this is a very long thought out thing that I've thought about actually in terms of editing and so it's just part of the part of the video and you just you know it's part of the this island is so far away seriously oh you know what this is that one island I bet and uh, because it's so far away it's freaking forever away Actually, it should render in here pretty soon. Nighttime in the open ocean is scary. But so here's here's some thoughts about things. So forgetting about the editing thing because we're done with that discussion now. Um, but in regards to there it is. In regard to the open ocean experience, one th one of the main problems is uh, when the storm rolls in, there are no waves. You know there needs to be high waves. Can you imagine what that would do? to the gameplay experience if you had to deal with crashing waves very intense waves or something like that it would be insane you would have all kinds of issues or even let's say like really really strong currents just paddling off an island could be difficult you know like so there are a lot of things that they can do to this game yet and a lot of things that will make this game very very interesting when what the? Oh, it is a boat. When uh, that happens, okay. Do I have a? I don't have a. I don't have a light or anything. Shoot. This is my. This is my home. Oh my gosh! I went the wrong direction. <laughs> oh gosh, man! I went the wrong way. Wow! I feel like an idiot right now. That's what I get for not playing for a week. Well, welcome home. The lanterns are lit up. Oh, you know what? Actually, this is fine because I needed to do something here. That, that This makes me feel stupid. Uh, maybe we'll go in another direction. Uh, what I actually I need to actually do now that I'm back is uh, I want to move all this stuff inside because that way... Freaking crabs. Don't touch Wilson. Get away from him. Oh, I want that on. You can turn on. I like that it still gets solar power. Yeah! It's a crab house. Freaking crabs, man. Like, they, how do they get in here? Get out of my house! Um, yeah, that... The whale isn't a problem anymore, but I still want to put everything... I don't need that anymore. Empty air tank. Why do I still hear the whale if he's not a problem anymore? Huh? There he is, right there. So I'm going to put everything in here, and that way um, that way things don't get scattered about. I still have got some rocks, though. That's kind of good. Crude axe. Okay. I thought the wheels weren't a problem anymore. I thought that was fixed. 
Guess not, huh? Got two jerry cans. I threw a jerry can away, which I feel bad about. Because I could have definitely used that. Maybe the whale isn't a problem. He looks like he's uh, going away or something, going, going around the island. Yeah, I needed to clean this up anyway. Somebody mentioned this, and I thought that was a great idea to actually uh, go through and move all this stuff in so nothing happens to it. Because, you know, sometimes I'm playing and I don't even realize... I feel like... I, feel, I really feel stupid right now, guys. I'm trying to... I'm just trying to, uh, like, ign ignore the fact that I thought I was going the right direction. But I went back to my face. Oh, gosh. Uh, yeah. Anyway, let's put this lantern... Uh, let's put this out here because then we have, like, some light pretty much lighting up the entire area. I kind of... I, sh I should probably take that torch with me. I should probably carry one with me. Because you find those all the time and I can always just get get rid of it. Let's take one with me. And then that way if I run into a situation where I, I uh, need it, I can, I'll have it for nighttime exploration. But it's about it's daytime now, so we're okay. Crap, I have so many things. Um, I wonder what you can... How you craft with that? Crude bandage, what does it use? Oh, cloth and duct tape, cool. Okay, where is it? Where is the bandage? Bandage will be good for uh Where is it where'd it go? If I get bit by a shark. Somebody said like sharks will actually drag you down and stuff, like that's gotta be freaking frightening. Actually, we can put those rocks outside. I don't need those in here. Am I am I just missing this bandage thing? What the heck? Maybe it's underneath. Keep the rocks right there. There it is. Oh yeah, I have a rock pile right here. Forget about that. Um, what was it saying? I don't know. I don't know. I'm like turned around right now. Um, was that it? I think so. Okay, now everything's inside, so nothing's going anywhere now. Oh, so that is like a, that's a crude bandage. Okay, well, it just stacks together. That's good. I was hoping that would do that. Um, okay, let's see. Okay, we're going to go in another direction, because I think that'll be the best thing to do. How am I doing for food and drink? Food's a little low. Uh, we don't want to eat that, because that'll completely restore us. What happened? It's okay, little buddy. I think he's dead. I think he's... I think it's dead. Ah, uh, I felt like I had a good thing I was talking about, then I just forgot what I was saying. Oh, I think I was talking about how, like, you don't... Like, it takes some... Sometimes I don't play for a while, and so, like, there could be, like, an update that something happens, and I'm not even aware. That's not high enough. Like, I think I was discussing about, uh, like, a w maybe, like, Tide coming or something like that and washing my stuff away. I don't know. Freaking break! Oh, my gosh. Will it break now if it's in... Yeah, it should in drinkable stage. There we go. Took forever. Oh! You guys. You know what? Oh, no, no. I don't need the lighter. Because I can always eat co coconuts. There's apparently like a new shark too, like a reef shark or something like that. I didn't even know that. I don't know. I have all kinds of thoughts about this game. Things that I would like to see happen. Because, you know, you know what's really interesting is like, people were always like, no, 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 it's a survival game. Because like, another game just came out like the other day. And, uh, <laughs> and it's like, man, there's like nothing with survival games. What's well, like, what else kind of game can you make like that's gonna catch on? Cause like, survival games caught on like, uh, I think it was like fair, kind of fairly recently, from what I remember. Probably before I started doing YouTube though. Oh yeah, let's put our bed inside too. Uh, before I started doing other videos other than War Thunder stuff. Oh no. Come on, come on, get in here! There we go. It's in. All right. I don't even have to flip it over, I don't think. I can just 
Leave it like that if I wanted to. <gasps> Wilson, I'm sorry. And guys, this is Wilson's house too, and he does not like it when you move him from his slumber. Oh wait, can I take this out? Somebody said I could do that. Break that down. Oh, you can, sweet. Thank you, community suggestion. Just trying to get things in order here. Trying to get my trying to get my house in order. Listen up, kids. Crabs. You uh you've been misbehaving. It's time for you all to die. Crab in. I don't want to sleep right now. I want to kill that crab. Infestation. Yeah, what up, sucker? Alright, let's go. We're going out of here. We're getting out of here. Alright, so let's see where I've already been I don't know. I've already been to pretty much every island that's like one out from from my base. And so I can't really say what to do. We're gonna go directly west. Okay, we're gonna go we're gonna go due west and go to that island over there. Man, I, <laughs> I feel so dumb. <gasps> Is that a oh I thought I saw a stingray. Don't tempt me like that. I have yet to see one. I don't think I have any, like, stingray around here. I mean, I haven't been in my island for, like, a long time to, like, actually check. There are also, like, reef sharks, too. That's, like, the new shark. Black reef sharks. But I, I don't know. I've never seen one of those, either. I don't even know what they look like. I could look it up. But, I don't know. How, like, are they, like, further down here, or... I'm so scared to get in the water now, man. Freaking sharks. Terrifying. Or, uh, I bet the black reef sharks are probably pretty fast, huh? Alright, where are we going? That island right there. Alright, let's head out. Man, I feel so dumb. What can I say? That's what I get for not playing for a week. Li there's uh, those lionfish. Seems tiger fish or whatever they are. Lionfish, tiger fish, I don't know what they're called. They sting you though. Look at these things. They're everywhere. Freaking plague. Well guys, uh, I'm going to call for the video right there. Uh, I got my rant out of the way. I also got uh, my base in order, which is what I wanted to do at some point, but I guess I'll just do it now. And we're going to head to this other island and see what we can find. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. And if you have, click that thumbs up button below. If you're new to the channel, welcome to the community if you subscribe. I don't think I've looted this place yet. Well, guys, I will see you in the next episode, and we're going to check this place out. So join me then.